Hi, I'm Heidi Nord and this article is titled, The Causes of Dyslexia. Dyslexia is often thought of as solely a reading disorder. When asked, many people will describe a dyslexic person as someone who reads letters and words in an inverted manner. While there may be some truth to this common notion, because it is a warning sign of dyslexia, it is largely misleading. A dyslexic person often has difficulty in different areas of learning, not just in reading. She or he may have difficulty with speech, writing, spelling, math, and memory. As varied as its manifestations are, the causes of dyslexia are also complex and not very well understood to the public. The National Institute of Health has studied dyslexia in scientific research studies, and they have found many commonalities in people with dyslexia. The first thing the National Institute of Health has found is that dyslexia is inherited. Research has shown that certain chromosomes are responsible for passing down from parent to child a dyslexic predisposition. Around 50% of dyslexic children have parents with the same difficulty. If a person who is dyslexic does not have a parent with dyslexia, it most certainly is found somewhere within the family tree. That is why when diagnosing dyslexia, it is important to look at the family tree to see who is either dyslexic or who has characteristics of dyslexia. The main difficulty with dyslexia is that it is a phonological processing related issue. This theory is that people with dyslexia do not process bits of sound properly. Failing to achieve this fundamental developmental task, the child's language skills become irreparably flawed, causing lifelong difficulties. Speech, reading, writing, and communication skills are all affected. People with phonological processing issues often will mispronounce words, such as saying hospital for hospital, or biscetti for spaghetti or they may leave the sounds out of words. For example, for the word stand, S-T-A-N-D, they may write stad, S-T-A-D. Basically, they are not hearing each sound within a word. Nothing is wrong, in fact, with their hearing. It's just that they are not processing all of the sounds within the word, therefore either mispronouncing it or spelling it incorrectly. People with dyslexia often show warning signs of dyslexia in their formative years. In fact, a delay in speaking is one of the first warning signs. Babies begin saying their first words at the age of one and phrases at about 18 months. Because dyslexia is a language processing difficulty, many warning signs can be seen in children at a very young age. A delay in speaking is one of the warning signs because it gives a clue as to how a person is processing language. Many students who have difficulties with reading and writing in school also have speech issues. Many students who are diagnosed with dyslexia have been seen first by a speech therapist. In fact, Many speech therapists are interested in dyslexia because they see that speech difficulties are a warning sign of dyslexia. Watch for difficulty with R's, L's, W's, M's, and N's. By and large, among the causes of dyslexia, the most widely accepted in scientific circles is heredity and that phonological awareness is affected. I hope you enjoyed this article. Have a fabulous day.